okay, for this problem, we want to find a break-even point. In other words, we want to find, figure out where profit is zero. All right, so notice the first thing we have to do is we have to come up with a cost function. And cost is always your fixed costs plus your unit cost times the quantity of things you're making. So there's our cost function. Our revenue function is typically our selling price, right there, times the number of things you're selling. So there's revenue, there's cost. If we were thinking about graphing these, oh, bad line there. All right, basic shape here. Uh, both of these are linear functions. C starts off at 1,000, and it's going to be a linear function going up like that. But revenue starts at zero, and it's going to have a steeper slope. So it might go up like that. And we're interested in that intersection. Um, where that occurs, let's label these. That's C. That's R. Where that occurs is our break-even point. After that point, we are making more money than what it costs. So yay, we got positive profit. So to find that point, we want to set these two equations equal. And this is pretty easy to solve. So that point right there corresponds to a quantity of 200 units. And that's how you find a break-even point.